We're Dave and Karen from Watts on Wheels and we've been RVing full time since December of 2017. We have a heavy duty truck that carries our spiders and pulls our fifth wheel and smart car. This video shows Dave caulking our slides. If you have any suggestions or tricks of the trade when caulking, please comment below. What you got going on, Dave? Recaulking the seams on the trailer. Okay. The RV. Why are you doing that? After a while, the seams crack open, water gets in, and water is not your friend. Did you remove the stuff that was there previously? Yep. You scraped out all the old caulk. Now, um, what kind of tool did you use? Okay. That's my handy dandy little scraper that I made out of a piece of PVC pipe. Oh, and you got put a point a little, on it. Put a little point on it and just keep scraping. That way it doesn't damage the paint. Why don't you use like, you know, a putty knife or they're some too, other kind of scraper? They're too flexible. Oh yeah? Yeah. And this just gets right in there and you dig away at it. And no scratching, huh? Not yet. Can you uh, show us? Oh, can I show you? I just put it right here and you just keep... Oh, you already got a lot of that off of there, don't you? Yep, wiggling it up and down. Uh-huh. And then it gets all that out of there. Now, do you have to use any alcohol or anything on that? I use a denatured alcohol after I'm done with it. And with done it. scraping it, you mean? Yep. Uh-huh. Clean all the, all the garbage out of it. So that's a denatured alcohol. Does that get rid of the residue or what? Uh, it gets rid of the dirt, some of the residue, cleans it up good so the new cock will adhere to it. And what cock are you using? I am using Life Seal. <laughs> RV Life Seal. RV Life You're Seal. You're using clear, huh? Yep. It comes in colors too, I think. It comes in uh, black and white and clear. And how much is one of those tubes? It's about 25 bucks a tube. Yeah, and where do you get it? From LifeSeal.com, I guess. Yeah, we can't. We've yeah, you got to buy it online. Can't, couldn't find it anyplace else. No. And it has to be the RV Life brand, not the boat brand. Right. There's a boat brand for marine and there's one for RVs. How easy is that to put on? Oh, it's simple. Easy as Just like any caulk? Any caulk. Yeah. And uh, you're using tape though to keep it where so you I, want I, it, huh? Yeah. Kind of like when you go painting, it's always uh, worthwhile putting the tape down first. Right. Keeps it nice and neat. I put a stripe of paint down, or a stripe of tape down this side. And then Just down. A, yeah. A little bit beyond that curve, that radius. So this life seal cock that you're using, uh, what have you heard about it? I've heard good things about it, that it lasts for quite a while. What's quite a while? Well, the one guy I've talked to, he says he's had his for three years done with it, and he hasn't had any problems. What other kind of cock have you used? I've used polybutylene, I've used silicone caulk, mm -hmm. and it, none of it seems to hold up. It peels up. How long does it take before that stuff comes up? A month? Six. Well, about two to three months. Uh-huh. And then uh, you're right back doing it again, so. So you did some of this uh, life seal on the other side of the coach. coach, and how long ago did you do that? I did that about three months ago. Okay. Still looks like day one. Oh yeah? yeah. Okay. Well we got uh, time will tell right? Time's gonna tell. Time's gonna be our judge. Yeah. But uh, a couple people you talk to swear by the life seal huh? Oh yeah. So it's a little dirty right now but um, taking a look see how this looks. It looks good. I don't see any splitting or cracking. If this stuff could last for even a year I'd be happy. Three years would be fantastic. Oh, that was quick. So you got your other side done for your tape. Yeah. Uh, I hate to tell you this, but this this uh, buggy needs a uh, good oh. cleaning. <laughs> your cock's pretty dirty over there. Uh, I know. Have you had any issues with water getting in? in the past. Uh, what happened? I had a floor rot out on me. Oh, slide. No, but that was before you, when you first bought it, it was already yeah. damaged. You didn't even know it, did you? No, I didn't. There's a whole other video on that.
there a reason why I use clear versus another color? Because I have a multi paint job, multi colored paint job. Mm -hmm. It would really show if I used another color. So you don't even have to wait for it to dry? No, right after you're done caulking. Yeah. You want to take this? I'll get it before it dries, huh? Yeah. Scraping. It takes a little bit, a little bit of doings. Oh, elbow grease, huh? Oh yeah, a lot of elbow grease. There's no easy way to remove that, is there? Ah, uh, I haven't found it yet. But you found that tool to be your best tool so far, huh? So far. Because it doesn't flex. It cuts it real good. It does. It gets it. Doesn't scratch the uh, finish on the RV. Nope. Well, you got you use two sides of a flex. Double ended, side. baby. Oh yeah. Hmm. Just gotta... So you made that out of PVC pipe. So you filed yeah. this side down for a flat side, and then you filed that side the for point side. Pointy side. Oh, ain't you smart? That is really hard. Sure it is. So Dave, you made a new one here. I sure did. This one looks longer than the other one. Which, show me how you use this one. And why did Same you create you a new one? It. I just made a new one for longer and put a, like a little nub on it. It's easier to hang on to. Oh. And turn around that way. Turn around this way. So, That's all. Huh. Okay. A little bit more leverage. Gotcha. Thanks, Dave. You're welcome.